Hello and welcome back to Transports Fever Series 2 The Great Lakes. Thank you very much for joining me in this episode. Last time out, we were working a little bit in Detroit, sorting out some of these roads, as you can see here, and uh, placing in some new roads, as you can see here. I'm still considering running a road all the way along there. I just... I'm not sure. I'm not sure because of the fact that... I just can't see how that road's going to really be able to... I suppose over here you'll get some buildings. Uh, cropping up, but I'm just not sure about laying that road in But one road that ran all the way around the lake would be kind of interesting. I I'm going to think about it I will think about it. But anyway, we were doing that and we were over in Toronto and We were doing some some work on the roads here as well So we're trying to clean up the roads trying to get roads working and it's a bit better upgrading some of the roads making sure that it looks kind of uh, neat which was the, the point of everything. In this episode, we're going to be continuing on with that, but this time we are going to be working in um, Columbus and Cincinnati and Indianapolis and Fort Wayne. If we can, we'll try and do some Pittsburgh and we're going to see, we're basically going to see how much we can do. We'll even try and do Buffalo in this episode. So make sure you stay tuned for the next 20 to 25 minutes for that. Okay, so here we are in Columbus. We're not going to waste any time. Let's have a look at what needs to be fixed. Uh, first of all, you can see that this road is wider. Is it wider? It is wider than this road. So we're going to narrow down this road and we're going to expand this road perhaps to ooh, maybe not that to four lanes, but we'll narrow down this road so that it conforms with the rest of this and see if we yeah, all of this is going to narrow down. So let's go ahead and do that slim large street upgrade. Um, that looks pretty good to me. And we're using some of the more apparently modern types of um, roads, but I'm not too sure. Do I really want to do that one? No. Could I narrow down this entire bridge though? I always found the bridge to be a little bit wide, but uh, no, I'll leave that, I'll leave that as it is. So we've done that one. And then we've got this one that goes across. I guess narrowing this down would really be better. That looks a lot better. And then this can remain wide all the way because I don't think it narrows at any point. No, it doesn't. So I'm happy with that one. And I think with that, Columbus is pretty much already done for us. The only problem I have... Hey, the only problem I do have is, I guess if we did that as a wide road, is getting these roads done. I guess that's the route that... Where, where do the buses go? See, so the buses go down that way and then around here. That could work. So that, that bit there and that bit across there. These are not going to happen. This could happen and then across here... Yeah, because that's quite narrow, so let's go ahead and do that as well. And remove those eight buildings, and that's good. Yep, that works for me. So I think with that, Columbus is already done. Very, very easy to do. Let's move straight on to Cincinnati. Let's have a look at Cincinnati. Uh, again, we could upgrade this road or downgrade it. Yeah, look, it goes narrower here. It gets narrower, so this is quite wide. So let's narrow it down, and then it goes wider than narrower. So let's see. Oh uh, yeah, then from a wide road it goes into a narrow city road. That seems to be okay. So let's go ahead and fix this. So we'll just ensure that this is done. Bridge pillar collision. Bother. All right, we're going to have to come back to that section. Although that section isn't. Having a look at that, that section is already narrow, right? So we don't, I guess we don't really have to do that. Could I narrow this bridge? No, it's... Oh, actually I can. There you go. Just narrow the bridge down a bit. You can actually see how much narrower it is. There and there. So there we go. And that being said, is it possible to then narrow this down? Well, it would have been had I not done that. 
Okay. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to do this first. Narrow that, narrow that whole bridge. Rebuild the road. And then we're going to have to put the bus stop back in. Uh, bus stop. Nope, that's trains. That's not going to help. Uh, bus stop. There we go. Okay, good. Then I suppose that would lead us to narrowing that road. And then all the way along we can narrow it. Which kind of works for me. There. Can I do that? Yep, I can do that. And then... Now, this is where things are going to be interesting. If I do that, is it going to ruin everything? I'm going to come back to that possibly, but with that being said, and all those changes done, I think Cincinnati looks ready to go. Yep, that looks ready to... Ooh, hang on. Yep, that's ready to go. Nothing, nothing seems to be sticking out to me. Everything seems to look good. All the roads seem to be connected correctly. All the sizes are good. The main roads are sorted out. That's pretty good. Let's move over to Indianapolis. Now, in Indianapolis, you can clearly see wide road, narrow road, wide road. Immediately going to fix that. Narrow road. Narrow road. Please work. Narrow road. Narrow. We'll loop this around. Now, how far do we want to loop this? I think looping it up like that is probably the wisest of ideas. Then that can be wide. That's fine by me. Any other roads that go wide, narrow? No. This one seems okay. Yep, that seems... Does that actually get narrower somewhere? No, it doesn't. So that's good. I guess I could upgrade these roads. Oh, this road needs fixing. Hello. Yeah, let's narrow down this. Oh, autosave at the worst possible time. Let's narrow that down. Oh, actually, I want to use the other road, don't I? With the Yeah, let's use it with the yellow. Okay. Right, why does this not want to go... Oh, did I not? No. no. I want a slim large street. Do I not have the... Oh, I don't. I don't have the yellow marked. Ah, well, what do you know? I learn something new every day. I guess uh, I can't do that road, but I can do this one. So if I were to run this along, and then run this along... Like that. But then surely I want to do this all the way along then. Up to this point. Yep, that makes sense. So that's a wide road. Coming in through there, that's a narrow road. In that case, I guess this all becomes four lane two. And that's already four lane, but a larger road. So I don't have any... I don't have any problems with that. And I could make that fall in, but I don't think I have to. So that looks pretty good to me. That looks good to me. So that's that done. Okay, so that's one, two. Wow, we're, we're really pottering along, aren't we? Now, Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh. That has a problem. Pittsburgh really has a problem, it does. So we're going to... First of all, we're going to narrow this... Now, you see, everything just comes up with this too much slope error. Yeah, it's just... We're running into errors left, right and centre with Pittsburgh. It's going to make things a lot harder to do. Right, with this, I guess... Do I just do that section there? I guess so. Probably need to narrow it a bit earlier. We'll, we'll have a look. So if I do that and then bring this down to the station. Where does it go from the station? Nowhere. 
So I guess it's only that block there that needs to have it. And then technically we probably want this to have it. Followed by that block there. That's still not going to allow me to upgrade the station though, is it? Huh. It will. It will let me upgrade the station. Finally. Finally, Pittsburgh Station. That's the picture. Pittsburgh Station, finally, after all these episodes, gets an upgrade. That's the screenshot for the episode, surely. I can't believe that's happened. Oh, no, actually, let's not do that as a screenshot. Let's do... I should probably pause it. Let's wait for a train to come through. Here comes another train. I can't believe Pittsburgh Station's finally had an upgrade. Oh, that's even nicer, that screenshot. You'll always find better screenshots every now and then. Okay. So, that's all that took. A billion years. Okay, so that's that done. Pittsburgh is done. Cleveland, I think, is done. It's a little bit... Actually, it's a little bit messy, isn't it? Let's fix Cleveland, too. Mm, I want narrow... If I'm going to do this, and I'm going to have four lanes, I'm going to put narrow roads all the way along this. So, not there, but all the way along here. Actually, no, these are going to... Yeah, these are going to be narrow. I was going to make them wider, but there's no point. That's going to become two-lane. So, we're going to swap that over to two-lane shortly. Um... Does this need to be four lane? Yes. Potentially up to there. And then we'll bring this around and we'll narrow out this road. And then along here, along here. And I guess we do this whole outside. So this whole outside loop is now going to be narrow four lane roads. That seems to work well. This None of this can work. Can this? This inside road can, so we'll do that. Yeah, look, over there there was a bit of a mess, so we'll fix that. That's that fixed. Now what we've got to do is go back to medium streets, make sure that we get the right medium streets in. That's good. We'll bring this all the way along. Uh, that's going to... Oh, that one will actually take the upgrade, so we'll do that. We'll do that, we'll do that, we'll do that. That one's okay. Too much slope, of course. What else would we get? Let's uh, do that. That's a four lane, right? Yep. Maybe I should do four lane up here too. I'm not sure. I don't think it's necessary. Ah, and this is a small street. Aha! Uh -huh. This is going to be fixed out of Toledo. Because that's a two lane road. We're going for a slim... Medium, slim, large country road. Is that what it was? Sure. We'll upgrade this. There you go. Better. Much better. Okay, that's Cleveland done. Now we just got to move on and see what else we need to do. Fort Wayne. I think in Fort Wayne that needs to be really fixed. I try to keep things as... Nope, see, look at that. That area. I was going to say, I try to keep things as simple as possible, but clearly it looks like uh, I missed a few spots. Okay, so that's the main... Where's the main loop? This is the main loop, so we'll make... We'll ensure that the main loop is all four-lane narrow roads. And then does that... Is that okay as a wide road? I guess so. I don't seem to have any complaints. I'm still concerned about them building roads like this. I am concerned about that, but uh, I don't think we can do much. Just checking what, where else can we... Right, we can fall in across the middle, so that seems smartish. 
to do. There you go. But we can't four lane across this because this part's too narrow. Otherwise, I'd four lane across that. Unless we do four lane across that and just remove those buildings. They should they should come back pretty soon. So there we go. That's Fort Wayne now done. Grand Rapids. Uh, any problems here? I think the roads are in fairly good condition. Those are all wider roads. Maybe I should swap them out for narrow roads, but they are all the correct size all the way around. Traffic can get around. I'm just looking to see where would traffic hotspots be. Along there. Around here. Coming into the station, this area, but that's all four lanes, so that's okay. So nothing to look at there. Buffalo. Buffalo surely has got a few things that need to be fixed. Uh, yeah, it's got these roads that are medium streets that have uh, gone into turned into large streets, and then they've got this one that looks like it's wider. And then this part's here. Yep, so let's fix that. Slim, large street. Coming up right away. Uh, and then I guess we can do this. So that road all the way now is a modern slim lot. Okay, let's do that too. And now we cut now this. Look at this. So we can't do that, but we can go up and oh apparently can we not go up and around? Oh, apparently not. Okay, going back to medium street. And we'll medium street that as well. Can we medium street that? We can. Now we've just got to find slim medium streets. And ensure that... Oh, come on. Right, we're going to run into a few more, few too much slope issues that we're going to have to deal with. Uh, okay, so too much slope is going to be an issue. So we fixed it in Buffalo, but we can't seem to fix it here. Well done us. Ooh, we could make this a large street all the way around. Yet, look, that gets wider. So, a slim large street coming right up. One slim large street and one auto save. There we go. Keep it coming. There we go. Perfect. Oh, and do that. Awesome. Can we just bring that down to complete the road? We can. No! Oh no. I'm so sorry that's not even the right one. It's that one. Ah, oh, I ruined everything. I ruined it all. Okay, but that's going to help the flow of traffic. Uh, provided we can upgrade these. Can we upgrade these? Or is this No, we can upgrade these ones. So where were we getting too much slope? It's there. How do I... I'm not sure how to even fix this. Ooh, but I can't... Oh no, I can't even upgrade that to a slim medium street. Can't... No. I can widen this street. Sort of. Well, that's only wide... Uh, that looks... That looks appalling. That really looks appalling. Okay. Okay, we're going to have to figure something out. And then this, I don't know what to do with this. They started building houses and whatnot, or shops there. Industrial buildings. Right, yep, yeah, okay, so they've started building industrial buildings there. What do you know? And I guess to end this, oh, we've got Philadelphia, Washington to go. Where there is a lot of mess around on the street. So we'll have to do that in the next episode. But I think we can have a quick look at Ottawa. Where well, the roads are remarkably well done. I can't see any glaring errors. Oh, hang on. No? No, that was just the hill. Anything here? Nothing here. That's pretty good. That is actually pretty good. So, no problems with Ottawa. We've just got Philadelphia and... Uh, sorry, Philadelphia and Washington. Did I say Chicago at one point? I'm not sure. I've just got Philadelphia and Washington to fix up. So that's pretty good. Let's uh, save this and we'll play it 
And we'll have a look at Cincinnati and Columbus just to end this episode, just for a moment or so. And we'll go back to it. So we've got a bunch of new four-lane roads in areas. That's just neaten things up. Narrower four-lane roads, which actually work better. We could probably adjust these at some point to those. Oh, that's a problem. It actually sticks on the road. That's no good. Mm, well, we're not going to keep that, I don't think. Must be because of the slim roads or something. I love the lights, though. That's how it should be. Okay. Oh, we need to fix that. Hello. Uh, we'll fix that. Well, I'm not saving this. We're, go we're gonna have to fix that after. Cincinnati seems to still be running absolutely fine. Off camera, I'll try this. If it works, then in the next episode, I will put it on. If it doesn't work, then in the next episode, you won't see it. Everything seems to be okay. And last but not least, such a better flow. I only wish that that was four lanes into the into the depot. But look at that. A much, much better flow going in and out of that. Thank goodness for that. Thank you very much for watching. Please remember to hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to the channel for more videos on Transports Fever. Series 2, The Great Lakes. Don't forget to uh, also subscribe to watch Transport Fever Series 3, The Great Western Railway. And also, if you want more information about that and how that's going along, don't forget to support me on Patreon, www.patreon.com slash ecgadget. Your supports will be massively, massively appreciated. You can also follow me on Twitch if you're not watching this on Twitch, at twitch.tv slash ecgadget, and you'll find me on social media, that is, Twitter and Instagram, at ecgadgetlp. That's all from me, and I'll see you guys next time in Transport Fever Series 2, The Great Lakes.